We need to get a little edge. Riley McKay second in the ECHL, 122 penalty minutes as Cleveland left wing side. Brendan Gantz fires and scores. Cleveland with the quick break left wing and Brendan Gantz takes it down for his team leading a 10th goal on the season. And the Monsters take a one to nothing lead with 13.55 to go in period number one. Cleveland continuing to put on pressure on the Hogs in their defensive end. And Gantz able to get away a clean shot from the left wing circle and it gets underneath the catching glove of Colin Delia. But Mitchell's going to track it down as it wraps around the near side boards. Comes out to the blue line for Regula across the ice. Chris shot, they score! Dmitry Osipov grabs his first of the year, and we're tied up in one with 10.08 to go in the first period. First goal, first point for Dmitry, and he is all smiles, making his way back to the ice hog bench this season, converted from defense to forward. Had a couple of conversations. He says, I'm just waiting to get my chance and have that puck hit the back of the net. And yeah, his teammates putting him in a big old bear hug in front of the ice hog bench. Nice shot, Dimitri, from the left circle. And it's a brand new hockey game. Still getting some hugs. The whole bench standing. Pass across. Nobody there. Now Cleveland with some jump right hand side. Brendan Gons backhander. They score. Brendan Gantz able to find a target across the ice and get that one to uh, bounce on past Colin Delia. And this is going to be Tim Burney, or pardon me, no. Cole Fonstad jumping up in the rush. As we take a look at the replay, again, it all started with the pass by Nicholas Bodain that just got in goal down to my right hand side 16 saves on 18 shots he was busy in period number one jet greaves out there for cleveland seven of eight through 20 minutes it's the monsters shorthanded off the face off they score what a start for the monsters is carson meyer shorthanded goes right off the opening a puck drop and goes to the right circle puts it on target goes post and in on colin delia and for castle's active stick hardman has to get rid of it goes across the ice he's got regula on the top of the near circle the buzz decker one timer to hardman he scores Mike Hardman pulling the trigger from the right circle. Gets it between the legs of Jed Greaves and the Ice Hogs. Get a power play goal and they pull back within one. Regula to the middle of the ice for Buzz Decker. And that might have been partially blocked on its way and hit off a member of the Monsters. But Hardman will take it trying to see who that might have clipped off of. And yeah, I think that might have been Tim Burney that dropped down to a knee. And it got a piece of him on his side. And that's what changed directions of the pitch. Trying to knock it free. Ospop does bop it loose, but Meyer gets it back, goes to the middle of the ice for Tyler Angle. Angle looking to go to Delia for the one-timer. They score! Returns over to Carson Meyer, right side. Angle to Meyer on the one-timer. Delia got a piece of it, but not enough. It bounces across the goal line as he went diving from right to left. Almost a miraculous save by Colin Delia, but Carson Meyer is going to grab his second goal of the game. And his eighth on this season and makes it a 4-2 Monsters lead with 11.38 to go in the second period. Watching that little miss seven points. Stenland, same output for him. In fact, Kevin Stenland finding the back of the net on the five-on-three power play last night for the Monsters. And he's going to catch it off the faceoff. Fire and score! Right on cue, Kevin Stenland off the draw. Works it to the middle and then just tees it up just on the inside of the left circle. A power play goal for the Monsters. And they take a 5-2 lead with 1.16 left in the second period. Quick face-off win and they find Stenlin who just moves to the middle. Sizes up a shot and goes low to the glove hand of Colin Delia. Them. He had a good one lined up though, but it just stayed back on the heel of his stick. Puts it out to the blue line for Bodain. Wrist shot, they score! Nicholas Bodain from the deep slot downtown. And the Hogs, 30 seconds into the power play, connect. And it's a 5 3 contest. I think that was deflected on its way as we can try and get a look on the replay. 
Regula, after that fan shot, recovers, puts it back on to Nicholas Bodine. And I think it hit a fallen member of the Monsters just outside the crease late in the hockey game. Kalnick on to Alec Regula, looking for a lane, nothing available. Hands it over to Kalnick, on to McLaughlin, fires and scores! Hogs are within one, hang on! 44 seconds left on the power play. It will become a five on four as Delio will return to the goal crease. And Dylan McLaughlin, the point streak now on to four contest as he sets one up on a great one-time shot from the right circle. And we'll see, Alec Regula is going to grab the secondary assist, and that is now a four-point game. Four helpers for Alec Regula, tying a season high from Lucas Reichel last weekend, who had two goals and two assists against the Chicago Wolves in the 8-0 victory, and that was the first time an ice hog had a four-point game since 2015. 